Okay. I have decided to start a second game of Satisfactory to explore an idea I want to try. Um, I'm still working on my first game. I'm a more than halfway through it, probably. Not quite into nuclear yet, but I'm well into oil. Um, but my factory in the first game is just a total disaster. It's a tangled mess. It's getting really, really hard to backtrack conveyors to see where they go, and when you want to tweak the production lines, it's just a nightmare. So I got it into my head, and I haven't seen anything on YouTube or anything. I mean, I've seen some beautiful architectural monstrosities people have posted on YouTube, but I haven't seen anything about this. This was just something I wanted to try for myself, and I didn't want to see anybody else's experiences with it. I, I just got the idea that the most logical thing to do would just be to have a huge stack of conveyors down the center of the factory. Now, I don't really know how practical it is to keep going with this. It's already getting pretty darn high here. Um, curiously, um, the build gun still reaches. Uh, hold on a second. Let me just, like, grab. See the... I can still put stuff up there. Even from here. So I'm amazed that the build gun has that much range. Um, but it is getting a little awkward working from here, which is one of the reasons I put this catwalk in up top. So, when I start adding some more belts, it gets a little easier to manage. Whee! But this idea just really kind of works. Uh, everything basically on the left side here is base production. You know, just ingots and, you know, the basic really simple raw materials. And as the factory grows in this direction, it'll be more and more complicated items, and some of these items will get added to the big giant stack of assembly lines, like uh, like that one there. That's uh, that's wire, oh, cable actually. So I'm assembling cable there and adding it here, and it'll propel down through the rest of the factory to get pulled off as needed. Uh, like I'm making iron pipes here, and that's getting added to the top because it's the last thing I did, and we'll just propel down. Um, so I'm just going to keep growing the factory in this direction. i got a beautiful spot, and uh, I should be able to, uh, to keep going quite a ways. And it's just making it... I'm going to jump here and just use the jetpack. It's just making it so elegant and clean, because whenever I just want to slap an assembler down, I just put it down, and I'm leaving room here for, like, assemblers that is associated with this product. Like, sooner or later, I'm probably going to want to make more wire, so I'm going to just, you know, maybe have another wire assembler next to here, maybe two or three. So I'm keeping a lot of space open. But it's just nice just to plunk down an assembler, or a, a builder, and just just grab a conveyor and connect it to what you need. Like this. You know, it's just, boom, just connect it to the, to the conveyor you need. And it's just looking very neat and clean as far as, you know, access. I mean, I know people on YouTube are doing beautiful things like hiding everything underneath the floor and stuff, but I just, I just want this to be more functionally clean. And this has been working out really nice. Uh, so I have these little pass-throughs here to get under the belt, because I realized I couldn't cross the belt. And for the most part, most of the basic materials are being manufactured off the platform. Like, uh, see, I got the wire coming in from the Caterium mine, and it's just being made there. I am bringing in the quartz because later on uh, I'm going to have to turn the quartz into uh, what there's a. Uh, well, actually, I'm doing it here already. The, uh, oh, what is this stuff? I forget. Silica, yeah. Duh. 
brain dead. So I'm bringing it in and just making the silica here and quartz crystals here. And this was my first iron mine, and it was very close anyway, so I just crammed it in here. I almost regret doing this. I wish I'd just backed it off. Whoops. And made more room. But it's okay. It's worked out. It all fits nicely. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm really liking this. See, I'm bringing in some more iron plates from the other side, but I'm just combining it here into this one stack that's going up. And as these conveyors grow, I'm speeding them up. They're all at least Mark III now. There. For what it's worth, that's what I'm working on. I'm still playing the, uh, the first game, but uh, this is more of a creative experiment to see how I can lay out a factory much neater than I'm doing in my original game. And I'm liking it so far.